Hello everyone and welcome to our Excel tutorial series. In today's video, we'll learn how to effortlessly look up a value and retrieve data from the second column. If you're a beginner, this video will improve your learning efficiency. In this tutorial, we'll guide you step by step through the process of using the VLOOKUP function or index and match combination to search for a specific value and retrieve the corresponding information from an adjacent cell. These functions are particularly useful when working with extensive datasets, where manually scanning for data becomes time-consuming and error-prone. Let's get started. The first, look up a value and return adjacent cell by VLOOKUP function. If you have data in columns A and B, and you want to look up a value from cell B2 in column A and return the adjacent value from column B, you can use the following formula based on VLOOKUP function. Types equals VLOOKUP. Select D2. Select A2 to B7. Enter 2, select false. Then press enter. The value from D2 is stored in A3. The correct adjacent value from B3 is returned. The VLOOKUP function searches for a value in the leftmost column of a range and returns a value in the same row from a specified column. This formula searches for the value in cell D2 within the range A2 to B7 and returns the value from the second column, column B, in the same row. The second, look up a value and return adjacent cell by index and match combination. The index and match functions can be used together to achieve the same result. Index returns a value from a specified range based on the row and column numbers, and match returns the relative position of a value in a range. Using the same data as before, you can use the following formula to achieve the desired result. Types equals index. Select B2 to B7. Types match. Select D2. Select A2. A7. Enter 0. Press Enter. This formula searches for the value in cell D2 within the range A2 to A7 and returns the value from column B using the index function. These two methods provide different ways to look up a value and return an adjacent cell value in Excel. Choose the one that suits your specific needs and data structure. Thanks for watching my video. Bye.